After months of speculation, Verizon today announced it will begin selling the Apple iPhone next month. According to Fox News, Verizon Wireless will begin selling the iPhone 4 on February 10, 2011. During a press conference earlier today, Verizon COO Lowell McAdam made the big reveal. According to reports, Verizon's iPhone will start at $199 for the 16GB model. The 32GB Verizon iPhone will set you back $299. Engadget says current Verizon customers can start pre-ordering the Verizon iPhone on February 3, 2011. Non-Verizon customers can begin ordering on February 10, either online or in Verizon stores. The Verizon iPhone requires a two-year activation. Current Verizon customers who want to check on their eligibility and pricing for the iPhone 4 plans can do so on Apple's official website. According to Verizon, its iPhone will rely on the company's 3G CDMA network, not its 4G LTE network. Tim Cook of Apple is quoted as saying that Verizon's LTE network Work would force design changes that Apple wouldn't make. Engadget reports that the Verizon iPhone is basically unchanged, though it will have a new antenna design. In addition, the phone will act as a mobile Wi-Fi connection for up to five devices. Will Verizon's announcement result in a mass exodus of AT&T customers over to Verizon? One analyst says that's not likely. Gartner analyst Michael Gartenberg is quoted by Fox News as saying that because a lot of AT&T customers are still under contract, any mass migration is not likely. For more information on this topic, visit the link below.